And we are live from Philadelphia, said to be a city of firsts. And the first time I saw a spinal cord wrapped around a goalpost was right here at Too Big to Fail Financial Stadium. Remember, in the MFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The Motor City Maniacs battle the Philadelphia Eagles. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Oh, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. It's a beautiful day for MFL football. At least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? I'm doing that little hottie who works at Deep Fry at the concessions. He said, how, not who, you idiot, even if you got the answer right. And it's first and ten. That's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of crowd mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, And that'll bring up third and one. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. Yeah, man, I was here on the panel now. You know what happened? Third down and long. Nicely done, picks up three on that pass play. Ooh la la. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt return to pow. And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and it's first and ten. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. First down and three.
Right Rage ignites that deep down violent rage. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. up a two. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And Briggs, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. Third down and the punter is warming up. He's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out because if he gets hit, he is dead. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And that pass play is good for eight yards. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. And he just slipped away like a... It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. We've got a nail biter at the end of one. four-yard gain. Second down and six. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and six.
This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from top. Now, these penalties have really gotten out of hand, especially since they're fake. Go to dirty tricks and hit attack ref. It feels good. Ballsy. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe I actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snag. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Complete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Ah, uh, they love to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Second down and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all you can eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Clap the offense's toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go, Don't You Eat the Yellow Snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Second down in a very lot. You know this berserk dirty trick. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. And the NFL winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Third down and nine. Calling turkeys on Thanksgiving. The NFL playing. <laughs> A Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done.
No little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. And that'll be second and eight to go. You've got to catch that. Third down and eight. Runs it for four yards. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. I'd be impressed if he splits the uprights from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! <laughs> The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, what a punishing hit that was! And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. They run it for a yard. <laughs> the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. Second down and nine. Should throw it and catch it too. Third down and nine. Oh, with the brain scrambler. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> Second and eight to go. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The 
teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, throw in the half. Can you pick me up a soy like beer? The teams come out of halftime. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Oh, my God. The defensive player looks like he's lost He's it. leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Continues to climb. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Second down and more offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this. A mix of tiger blood, shark blood, and internet comments. Roy Rage brings out the worst in anyone. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting in the end zone. Except he's so First and ten. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Jet 
you son of a bitch! First down and six. There's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. Yeah, man, I was huge on the schedule now. They all have. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Second down and long. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Second down in a very lot. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. First down. And it's first and ten.
extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! That's the end of three, and it's one's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. hit and it's first and ten nice pick up for six yards Second down and four. And the defense calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Gonna make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. And it's first and ten. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. Well, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. And the QB might as well. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? Third and two. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Steam a gain of seven there. Second and three. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math exactly 
And it's first and ten. First and ten. And that's some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. yard on that one not my yard got too much buried in you know the usual money bodies call two minutes left in the game thank god i gotta take a wicked dump feel like i'm sitting on a wax candle not on my shoulder you know the kicker should make this but you know how it goes in this league he is automatic nice kick boring just get the points and let's move on The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. The boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. <laughs> you know what they say? Sometimes the best <laughs> Kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. friends was an all-pro NFL hit the offense goes into their two-minute drill what the hell is that it's the same thing in the hurry-up offense you moron I am so confused man what a hit that was <laughs> and that'll be second the offense calls a timeout this is why you save your timeouts you can use them in the two-minute warning now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. First down! He was 
not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it, the quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. Now this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one right before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. A little too mutilated. It's good. I think I showed my Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Luke Warm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Luke Warm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. It's the Eagles declaring victory today. Well, looks like I'm declaring bankruptcy. I've been on the wrong team again. They managed to prevent a home crowd riot by barely defeating the opposition by one friggin' point. Graham's Mulligan, before no. the apocalypse, he went to the Stones' 90th anniversary tour, and the crowd rushed us. Yeah, you told me this one. Yeah, Nick was in his wheelchair, and his yeah. colostomy bag exploded yeah, all right. over the front. Fascinating. Like Let's listen to the MVP now, Brickhead. <laughs> with Brick Ed Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every other...